Metal Gear Solid V, the Phantom Pain, has very cool mods. For example, you can play with Quiet instead of a Snake, and this mod comes with animations and sound effects. There are even other options that change Quiet's out of it, which means you can play the Quiet with its other out of it. You can even play with a Skull Sniper. This mod is also supports animation and sound effects. There is more. You can play with Paz too. This mod is also support animations and sound effects. It's great. And there are other mods for this game that includes the appearance of the characters. For example, Quiet without stacking and gear. This mod removes Quiet stacking and its gear. Or the Naked Sniper, a Quiet Nude mod. This mod makes Quiet completely naked. If you are looking for a nude mod, I recommend this. Now if you want to install them, let me show you how. There are several ways to install these mods. I am going to show you all of them. First, let's install them using Snakebite. The Snakebite is a mod manager that you can download from the Nexus Mods website. I put the download link in the video description. Come to the file section and download it. After the file is downloaded, extract it with WinRAR. You can drag and drop it like this. Now we install it using Snakebite installer. Go through these installation steps. Specify the installation location here. And continue. Let it install. After completing the installation process, you can see the Snakebite icon on your desktop. Now let's download one of the mods that we want to install. For example, I want to install Play as Quiet, so I will download the main file from the file section. After it is downloaded, I open the file with WinRAR and extract the contents to a desired location. Now, if you open these folders, you will see files in MGSV format. These are the files we need to install this mod. Now open a snake bite. When you see this screen, click next. Now in this section, you should find the Metal Gear Solid V the Phantom Pain installation directory. After you find it, click on the mgsvtpp.x file and click open. Now click on next again and again. And yes. Now wait a little. When you see this screen, click on OK and continue and finally done now we can install the mods click on mods in this launcher now click on install.mgsv files in this window now we need to find the mgsv files that we extracted from the downloaded mod file then we select them and click on open and finally we click on the continue installation process and OK. We wait a little and yes, the mods are installed. Now we can run the game and see the mod. And remember that the installed mod is replaced on a female character, a female soldier. So in this section, we must select a female soldier to view the mod. Getting this female soldier is a difficult task. That's why I suggest you Try the next method of installing the mod. But first let's learn how to delete them. Open a snake bite, click on mods, now select the mod you want to delete, then click on uninstall checked mods. Now hit OK and done. And the next method. In this method, I install multi-quiet player mod. From the file section, 
download both files, the main and the optional file. After you download them, open both of them with WinRAR and extract the folders inside them one by one to a desired location. Now first open the multi quiet player mod version 2.3 folder. Here we see 4 MGSV files. Install them using Snakebite. Open Snakebite, click on mods, then click on install.mgsv files and now find these files, select all of them and install them. Wait until they are installed. After completing their installation, we go to the MQPM tool and then MQPM tool version 2.3.x file. Now, I am going to use this tool to replace quiet directly to a snake. For this, first select an output path. I open a new folder on the desktop and name it MGSV and click OK. Now, select a snake in the player character section and in the players out of it section we select one of the snakes out of it that we want the mod to be installed on i choose battle dress now in the characters out of it section we select any of the out of it that we want to have for quiet i choose default also choose which option you want in the characters head section and in the hip weapon section, there is only one option at the moment. Just leave it alone. Well, after selecting all the options, click on process and over. Now, if you open the MGSV folder, you will see that new content has been created inside it. Now we have to convert them to MGSV file to install them. Now open the makebyte.x file. This file is installed with a snakebite. Open the snakebite installation directory, then you will see it. When you see it, open it. In this window on the right side, in the mods file section, you should find the MGSV folder that you created on your desktop. When you find it, select it and open it. Now in the left field of mod information, Give a name to your mod, write its version, it doesn't matter what you write actually, just write it. After filling them all, hit build mod and choose a location for it. Then write the name of the file, it doesn't matter what you write. Then click save and over. Now if you open the folder, you will see that you created a file called MGSV. Now install this mod using Snakebite. Like we installed other mods, open Snakebite, click on mods, then install.mgsv files. Now we have to find this mod file that we created and select it, then open it and click continue installation, then OK, and over. The mod is installed. If you run the game and choose the right out of it, you will see the mod. And the last way to install the mod. This time I choose the play as pass mod. I will download it first. After the file is downloaded, I extract it with Vayner. And now I download another file which is MGSV mod tools. I put the download link in the video description. After downloading this file, I open it with WinRAR and extract the folder inside it. Now I open the PAS3 final folder and open the readme.txt file and I copy this part of his writings. 
Now I open the MGSV mod tools folder, then the MGSV QAR tool folder. Now I open the dictionary.txt file and paste the text I copied here. Then I open the installation directory of Metal Gear Solid V The Phantom Pain. And I open the master folder. Now inside the MGSV mod tools folder, I open the MGSV QAR tool folder. And now drag and drop the chunk 0 dot dot file located in the master folder to the MGSV QAR tool dot x file. Just drag and drop it. Now in the master folder, another folder named chunk0 and another file named chunk0 were created. Now I open the path to the final folder and copy the chunk0 folder and paste it into the master folder. When I see this, I click on replace files. And again, I open MGSV mod tools folder, then MGSV QAR tool folder and drag the chunk0 uh, file inside the MGSV QAR tool file. Drag and drop it again. That's it done. After it is installed, you can run the game. And choose a female soldier with a sneaking suit and headgear. That's it. The mod is installed. Enjoy. And to delete this mod, you had to back up chunk0 dot dot, chunk0 dot 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 original, chunk1 dot dot files. Because the only way to delete this mod is to delete the modded files and replace the original files. This was all the methods you should know to install MGSV TPP mods. I hope you succeed. Goodbye, until the next video. Guard post captured.